Hi, thanks for joining us. I'm your host, Marissa Monroy. Prepare to be energized and motivated. The city's economic development department is hosting a celebration of women's entrepreneurial spirit. Join us for the annual Women's Entrepreneurial Luncheon, recognizing the contributions of local women business owners. Panelists will share their insights and experiences in achieving entrepreneurial success and answering attendees' questions. Don't miss this chance to come network with other female business owners. RSVP at austintexas.gov slash edd. Are you passionate about dogs? The latest episode of ATX Spotlight shines the light on one of Austin City employees who enjoys spending time with shelter dogs. Hi, I'm Christopher Summers. I'm one of the IT project managers here at Austin Bergstrom International Airport. Pretty much anything it gets thrown onto our plate. All of the hardware systems that go into the Barbara Jordan terminal, like all of the displays, uh, the roadway signs that you see when you're driving in on Presidential Boulevard, uh, basically everything that you see would, would be virtually impossible to do without IT these days. When I'm not working for the airport, uh, I have a lot of hobbies. Triathlons are one of them. So as an athlete, what I like to do is go down and run with a dog. We have a program here as a charter member. Oh yeah, Hercules, you man. Of the rough tail runners. Okay, let's go, buddy. You have people who love dogs and love running, so they get together. This boy loves to run. And it helps the dogs become more social. Oh yeah. Oh, good boy. Helps them get exercise, which they desperately need. There you go, buddy. Gets them out of the kennel, gets them out of the shelter environment, which is really stressful, typically, for most dogs. He runs fast. The dude doesn't know he's missing one. All done? And the more comfortable they are with either walking, oh, okay. jogging, or running. Here we go. Uh, on the trail with people, the higher their adoption rates, typically. Let's go, buddy. It was a special needs dog. There was an emergency plea that went up for a foster. There we go, that's a good girl, let's go. And my previous dog had passed away several years prior, so I thought, well, I'll do a foster. He'd actually been hit by a car. His name is George Oscar Bluth. Uh, he was on the cover of Austin Fit. 2015 is Austin's fittest dog. I fostered him for two years, trying to get him adopted, and then eventually just said, ah, I'll just keep him. Uh, he basically adopted me. That's my pretty girl until I'm, you know, six feet under, uh, I'll just keep doing it, because it's a lot of fun. Yes, it's my Cleo. You did great today, sweetie. Yes. Oh, you're such a good girl. Let's go. Find out how you can volunteer for caring for Austin's fur babies by visiting austinpetsalive.org slash volunteer. Fall is a great time to get outside and celebrate nature. Roots and Wings, Austin's annual festival, is a community-wide event recognizing the importance of trees, butterflies, bees, and all the nature in our city. The two-week event runs from October 22nd through November 5th. Check out more than 50 free, family-friendly activities happening all across the city. To find out what is happening in your neighborhood, view the schedule at rootsandwingsfest.com. With more than 1 million calls received every year, Austin 311 is the city's information center and main point of contact for non-emergency related calls. This next segment provides an insight into how to report needed sidewalk repairs. Thanks, Marissa. Fall is here and we're all about taking cool summer walks throughout our neighborhood. However, those walks are less enjoyable when you have to avoid broken, cracked, and raised hazardous sidewalks. This month, give Austin 311 a call if you notice any broken or uneven sidewalks in your area. You can even download the Austin 311 mobile app and submit the sidewalk repair service request with a picture of the exact sidewalk and location of the concern. Once your request is submitted, the correct department will investigate the issue and any hazardous situations will be made safe with an asphalt level up within 24 hours. All permanent concrete repairs will be made as the resources become available. If you need to report sidewalk issues along toll roads, contact TxDOT at 512-832-7000. Let's make Austin better together. Back to you, Marissa. That's it for this week's City View. Thank you for watching, Austin. Be sure to catch up on all of the latest information on atxn.tv, our social media channels, and on our city webpage, austintexas.gov. Stay well, Austin.